Welcome to the Learning D2L podcast, where in each episode we look at best practices when using Desire to Learn and the various tools within the system. In this podcast, we're going to look at how to add existing content into modules in D2L. You notice I have a couple modules set up here, and if I go to my Dropbox tool, you'll notice I have a Dropbox set up. Under Quizzes, I have one quiz set up, and under Discussions, I have a discussion forum and the first topic is put in there. So let me go back to content. Now adding existing content, you know, there's a couple workflows or multiple workflows that you can use to create content. One of them is to create all the content out here on your various tools and then just place it into your course. The other is you can build it all here from the content page or you can use Course Builder. So there's a, you got a lot of options in building. This one we're gonna look at just adding existing content. And I'm inside module one. You'll notice I have a place here for new. That would be if you're building the content here. But since I have existing content, I'm gonna use the button to the right of it. This says add existing activities. And all you do is click the pull down. And I'm gonna go ahead and add that Dropbox. So click Dropbox. And there's the Dropbox listed right there. I'm gonna go ahead and click on it. And the Dropbox has been added. So whatever settings you put on the Dropbox when you put it when you build it, those are going to be applied to it here. Okay. Um, adding quizzes. Click on that. There's a quiz, and it's been added. And discussions add just as easy. I'm going to go to discussions. There's the only topic I have, and the only forum, and then this is the topic. And there is my discussion that's been added. So it's really that easy to add the content um, that you already have existing on your tools uh, for, into the content area as you build your course. Oh.